Halli, hallo und herzlich willkommen. Mein Name ist Grey Fox, der Cyber Ninja. Auf meinem Kanal gibt es WWE Games, RPGs, JRPGs, alles, was euer Herz quasi begehrt. Lasst auch gerne ein Like und ein Abo da. Das Ganze geht los nach diesem Intro. You sure are luckier than a skinny caribou in September. Lucky? I beat Sasha Banks fair and square. Don't ever forget the only reason you were there was because I was hurt. Yeah, but it wasn't you, was it? It was me. I was the one who beat Sasha Banks in front of millions. And you were still here crying about it. I am going to dedicate myself to showing the world the truth about you. That I deserve to compete with the best? I think they already know. Okay, tell me everything. How did it feel? Winning? I mean, it felt great, obviously. No, not that. I want to know about the ring, the ropes. How was the catering? Do they use real silverware or plastic? Oh, do they have extra underwear in case you get so excited that you pee a little? Um, I didn't ask. Did you shower after? Sorry, stupid question. I don't think I would, though. Talk about a sweat souvenir. I can't believe you beat Sasha Banks. Do you want to watch the match? I've recorded the whole thing on my phone. I've seen it about 30 times already. No thanks. I was there. I know how it turned out. <laughs> totally. I'm gonna watch it again, though, either way. Still can't believe it. Like everyone else, I was glued to my TV last night. Congratulations. A really impressive win, especially right out of the gate. Thanks. I'm glad I was able to prove myself. Let's not spend too much time in the afterglow. You still have a long road ahead of you. Time to get back to the grind. Wait, you expect me to keep training here? I beat the boss on Raw. I bet the only reason Mandy Rose didn't sign me on the spot was because she was jealous she never did anything like that. Listen, rookie, this is your second day. I could fill an arena with everything you don't know. So how about we ditch the attitude and get back to training? I get that you're gonna make me put in more time here. But after what I did last night, I'm taking a day off. No, you're not. Not without severe consequences. I'm not one of your bratty kids, okay? Your empty threats don't scare me. So why don't you go get HBK some coffee or something? I'm gonna find Fanny and let her show me some of my highlights. You had to go and make it personal. You might have beaten the boss last night, but let's see if you can beat your boss right now. That might be worth giving up my day off. I am a WWE Hall of Famer. My career will be remembered forever, and yours might just end today. You think you're going to end my career? Yeah. Even though you think my job is to get coffee, I'm actually a head trainer here. So this is what's gonna happen. If you can somehow beat me, I'll let you keep training. But if I win, Mr. McMahon is giving me the authority to say, you're fired. See you in the ring, rookie.
I hope that was a wake-up call. It was. For you. Don't doubt me. Don't challenge me. You'll just end up looking foolish. One of these days, that attitude is gonna catch up with you. Like how age has clearly caught up with you? Just let me do my thing and stay out of my way. Oh my gosh, were you so nervous? No. Beth Phoenix is no match for me, clearly. Is it weird that I find you both fascinating and terrifying? Everything about you is weird. Just don't, like, put up a shrine in your locker to me, okay? Sure. I'll take it down. So close. And yet so far. Oh wait, were you talking about Beth trying to get rid of me? Or you never quite making it? One of these days. You'll finally recognize the talent that is right in front of you. See you in the ring, Josie. Sounds like we almost got rid of you. You'll get rid of me soon enough, but it won't be your call. We both know it's only a matter of time before I'm moved up. Maybe, but there's a reason it hasn't happened yet. I know. Pure stupidity. I guess we finally agree on something. <laughs> 